Welcome to Anno 1800, folks. I am excited for this. Uh, a new DLC just came out, uh, Land of Lions, so we can go to Africa. And uh, it's been a long time since I've played, so we'll see how we do. Um, we'll start out in a sandbox. We will have less guidance. We will select this guy as our portrait. And we'll have... What will we have? Hmm. I think we'll have this uh, compass as our signet, and we'll have, choose the yellow color because I'm colorblind, and that's the one that's easiest to see. Hmm. So uh, yeah, and here we'll be called. Uh, Nerdy Nilsson. And continue. Yeah, those are fine. And we'll have custom settings here, and they're already set. I'll just show you. So we're almost up to expert. Uh, not quite, uh, but I think that's okay because I'm very rusty. So we have. A random seed of 3,000, starting world size is large, island sizes are mainly medium, the island difficulty is hard, the fertility is plenty, the mineral deposits are plenty, and the map is snowflake. We'll have Lady Margaret Hunt, Admiral Vicenza Silva, and Dr. Hugo Mercier as our opponents. All traders are on, the pirates are on hard mode. Um, our income is medium, inactive upkeep is on, construction cost refunds, there's a fee. So building relocation is off, I think I'll actually turn that on and pay coins. Yeah. Uh, trading posts, restocks are rare, city incidents are hard, quest frequency is rare, and influence is low. We have a flagship, we don't have a starting harbor, we have a medium starting capital, and we of course don't have a revealed map. We want the fog of war. No victory conditions at all. Let's save those settings and start the game. All right, it has been a while since I played Anno 1800, but I'm really looking forward to this. Uh, I haven't, really the only DLC I've played is the Anarchist. So uh, the Bright Harvest, the uh, the Arctic, the uh, Cape Trelawney thing, I haven't played any of that. So all of it is pretty brand new to me, which I'm really excited about. It's going to be a lot of fun. I hope you enjoy Anno 1800, and if you do, why not leave a like, and if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button as well, and the notification bell. It really means a lot to me with the likes and the subscriptions. It helps me out a lot, and I do appreciate it so much when you do. So, where are we? There's our ship. Whoops. Flagship at and your we'll head down this way, I think. Yeah, let's head down this way. I want to see if I can find a good island down this area. And it looks like there's one right there. So let, let's head down there and see what we can find. This is going to be awesome. I can't wait to play this. And look how beautiful the game is. It really is. Look at the water. I mean, it's just magnificent. Some fishies jumping around there. Oh, I love it. I've missed this game. I've missed this game. Now, the fact that we're playing this does mean that the frequency of Wasteland 3 will go down a bit. So we'll have four Wasteland 3 uh, episodes a week, and we'll have four... Um, Anno 1800 a week. 
So this is a great island. We have potato facility, grain facility, hop facility, and fur abundance. And we have a lot of clay. So let's slow down time. Raised a settlement. Attention to the so that we don't uh, fall behind. I do have some mods installed. We'll see if they work because uh, there was the new DLC, so I'm not sure if they'll work with, with that. But I guess we'll find out. So we'll build a road way up here. Actually, let's have a look at the island. What does it look like? It's a nice big island, isn't it? We have oil up here. It's a nice island. It's a very, very nice island. I am happy about this. Yes, All right. I already know who you are. I, I am Admiral Vicente so we'll Silva. Have a road going over here, and I think we'll have the town in here. Because then we can immediately build some logging here. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four logging camps. And we'll build a road out here. And up here, and then we'll just build the road like that, and like that, and then we need some uh, sawmills, and we'll have one, two, three, four of those. All right, so that's wood coming in once we start our town. And I think we'll start our town right here. And I actually want this to be a three-lane road. As we want... Um, we want trains. So, farmer residences... We can do four there. A new four there. Four there. And for there, once we start getting some wood in. All right. So that should get us started. That should get us started. So let's send our ship on and find some interesting places. There's a small island down there, but we'll, we'll check that out later. Let's actually head up. There's an island up here as well. Just head up way up there. Check it out. All right. Let's speed up time a bit. A competitor raised a settlement. Let me know if the sound is too high or too low for anything. We don't want that. Yeah, yeah. We need workers, but we are getting stuff done. And this isn't too far away, so that's good. So all of them can be served by our harbor, which was the idea, because that saves us uh, 10 timber in the beginning here, which gives us a bit of a boost in our production, I think. All right, there is Madame Kahina. My curiosities nice. come from far and wide. For the more discerning on. customer. All right, we now have the workforce that we need. Very good. And we now have enough to operate you. See, we need some fisheries as well. So, build you there. A competitor raised a settlement. Build you there. We'll build some roads for you. Okay, we discovered Black that island. Ready for orders. So where is the next one that we want to find? Over here. Let's come this way around. I guess someone will be settled there. That would be my guess anyway. Uh, let's go into build mode and let's slow down time a bit. Um, we want farmer residences. And we'll just build blueprints. Just plan out our city a little bit. So, like that. 
And we can have roads going around here, 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 and here. And we can actually upgrade some of them already. Um, let's put some more in. We'll do... I think we'll do like this. And like this. Uh, demolish the ones in the middle. You reach a new milestone. And then we'll probably have a road over there. Right, so now we can make work clothes and schnapps as well. Which is a good thing. Let's upgrade some of these houses. We can't build the fire station yet. So as soon as we can, we need to, because fires are bad. Most people would agree. All right, let's build this uh, three-lane road all the way here. Like so. And I think out here, We'll have uh, our work clothes. So we need some sheep farms. So let's build one there, one there, one there, and one there. And stick in some pastures for them. Population is getting up there, so that's good. We'll have these four here. Then we, of course, need a small warehouse, which we'll stick in here, and we'll upgrade that immediately. Upgrade a couple of these, and upgrade a couple of these. So that's work clothes coming in. We do need way more farmers. I think we need some more wood production as well, or timber production. Flagship ready for orders. Uh, let's head over here. It looks like we have someone here. I don't know who. Just exploring a bit. We actually have a quest over here. Let's see what she wants. I can't promise. A collection quest. Uh, sure. Let me know when pick up flotsam. Okay. So where is the flotsam that we need to pick up? It's down there. So we'll head over the way that we were going anyway. Right. We need more workers. So let's uh, upgrade these, upgrade that. We can build the fire station now, which I think Tell we'll do behind mortal, there. And not yet another crook-fingered wretch. Just need a bit more timber, then we can get that done. Okay. Yep. We're losing money right now, but that's to be expected. Now, schnapps, I think we'll produce up here, and now we'll find out if our uh, if the mods work, because they do. Because we only need 36 fields, and uh, normally it's 72, so I have a mod that reduces the number of fields required, because... Uh, it's just too many I feel, fields, I feel like. The farms take up way too Worry much space. Not. You've nothing to fear from Hugo personally. Alright, there's Hugo. There is a rampant beast. Alright, uh, and then... Think of them one, two, three, four. And a road. And a small warehouse. Alrighty, 
so that's ready to go when we have the population to do so. Which we will soon enough. Alright, so we can see here, if you're unfamiliar with the game, our farmers here, they have needs. So this is an unhappy farmer because she doesn't have any, she doesn't have enough work clothes and fish is just barely there. The market is green, so that's fantastic. That's just as it should be. And then there's happiness over here and they need schnapps and a pub. We haven't built a pub yet, so maybe we should do that. And the pub could be over here on the other side. Uh, we need 10 timber for that, so we can do that soon enough. All right. Uh, let's sail south. Down this way. We still have 27 minutes to pick up the flotsam and get it back to her, so we're okay there for now. Let's upgrade that. So now we have a pub as well. And we need to get the warehouse here upgraded soon. Let's at least temporarily build some more. I am a humble servant of Her Majesty, called upon for delicate occasions such as these. Hello, right. Archibald. Upgrade, 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 and upgrade. So, there we go. We have schnapps. Well, we have more timber production. We don't have schnapps production yet. So, what's happening here is we have the lumberjacks master? huts here. They bring this over to the sawmill, the, the logs over to the sawmill, and then the sawmill will bring it to the small warehouse where we can use it for anything we like. Uh, let's see, we'll upgrade you. Why turn your nose up at the so he likes the potatoes, but as soon as I spill schnapps production, Perhaps then he doesn't like it anymore. Let's upgrade some more buildings. There we go, we can upgrade even more. Very good. Now, where is this uh, election quest? Let's sail down there. Now, the pirate is in the middle, usually, anyway. I, I think always on the snowflake. Please, couldn't look me out, uh, could you? Puzzle quest from one of our residents, sure. Find and collect the farmer's husband. Where is he? Ah, he's at the pub. There he is. Keen as a three-leg goat. All right, she gave us some potatoes. Not the greatest gift in the world, I'd say, but it's fine. Uh, let's upgrade our second fishery here so that it's actually producing some fish. And how are we looking? No schnapps. All the others good. So now we can upgrade our residents here, our farmers, to workers, which means a higher tier of, uh, of population. But before I do that, I want to get these upgraded. So we, you want to, to basically get your, your population up and uh, get to the higher tiers of population as fast as you can. Uh, because the higher tier population, the more they pay in taxes, which means uh, more money for you, more income. So you can see now the, there are these arrows over some of the farmer houses, and that means that I can upgrade them to workers. But I'm not quite ready to do it yet. Have you arrived yet? Not yet. Here to hunt me down. Oh, there's Lady Margaret Hunt. My spirit is already free. You can she has actually uh, that's, that's the quest. That's the quest that we already have. She doesn't have a quest for us. So there, and then we need to get back to Madame Kahina. I want to check here. Don't first. tell me I've missed another no. appointment. 
All right. Uh, so I wanted to see if he had some um, some steel beams that we could buy because we're gonna need those. All right. Let's get this upgraded. This upgraded. This upgraded. And this upgraded. And we need more houses. So let's do this. This. Whoops. Up there. And then we can do another row like that, I guess. And here we'll do three like that. Actually, let's do four like that. And we'll do the same on the other side. And we'll have roads going around here. So all buildings need to be connected by a road. You can't have a house in here in the middle, for instance, so that's why I demolish them. Uh, but the sp uh, space is useful for, uh, for other things, uh, such as beautification. Uh, and we do need beautification eventually. So let's upgrade all of you. And that will Fresh probably put a dent in our fish. So we'll build another fishery. There. And then I think I will upgrade some farmers. Anarchy is all for there we go. Your humble worker. I will ensure their suffering. So now we have workers here. And then there's engineers. You I reach. don't know, you know you why they're there stuff. already. We need artisans first before we get engineers. So I don't know why they're there already. But now we have a farmer workforce and a, a worker work. workforce. That's all we ask. And we need to balance that. Well, let's head up here. Now, the most important thing to get as soon as you get workers is clay. There's a clay pit right there. And as you can see, it takes 30 seconds for a clay pit to pump out some clay. And it takes one minute for a brick factory to process that clay. So we need two brick fa factories for each clay pit. So we'll do like this. Just run that road down there for now. And then we need the small warehouse. Uh, we do need more workers though. So let's upgrade some. Now we have 60. That sound normally means that there's a fire, but I don't see one, do I? Yes, there it is. But we do have the fire station, so that's good. All right, we can uh, upgrade this. We can upgrade one of these. And that means that we start getting a bit of bricks in. But we do need more upgraded farmers so we'll do that because uh, this takes 25 worker workforce so we need a bit more timber then we can get this going speed time up, up attack done? yes it's done so there curious. we get 2060 there's our second brick factory, so now we'll start getting bricks, which is really important because you need it for pretty much everything in the worker tier. So for sausages, we need... Uh, oh, for the pig farm, we just need timber, but for the slaughterhouse, we need bricks. 
So yeah, very important. Very important. Let's upgrade some more. Let's upgrade you guys you here. A new milestone. All right, city upgraded to a port. Uh, let's see. Do you have steel over here now? No. Does anyone have a quest for us? No. Well, I do want to get over there. On our way. And I kind of want to go up this way. Because I want to buy steel from him as soon as I can. Oh, we're losing money. Something happened. Uh, a competitor we raised a settlement. We need some schnapps. We need some schnapps. Let's upgrade two of these. That took our farmer workforce down a bit, so let's upgrade this block. Now, the market here does cover everything it looks like. Just barely, anyway. So, that's some more farmers on the way. Let's upgrade this as well. And let's upgrade some workers, or some farmers to workers. Like so. Right, that gives us some more workers. Alright, I think our pigs will be going in down here. Here. So this warehouse is actually a little bit overloaded isn't good so if there's uh if the warehouse is closer than the uh framework knitters here so we have the sheep farm who needs to take uh, wool to the framework knitters but these two will stick it in the warehouse first and then they'll take it to the framework knitters if which puts pressure on the warehouse so and warehouses are really expensive to uh, to upgrade, so I think what we'll do is we'll stick another warehouse in here somewhere. Where will it fit? Let's put it there. Alright, that should help with that. Let's have a look at demand. Everything is good. Schnapps is getting there. So that's good, and we can double our schnapps production as well. And we are actually turning a tiny profit. We are Flagship actually turning a tiny profit. So that's good. Alright, let's upgrade you. And you. You and you. All right. And we have a quest here. I'm happy as a sand boy. Your photography you quest. Girl, yeah, sure. Uh, photograph fighters. All right. We have some fighters there. Uh, continue. A competitor raised a settlement. That's another quest that we're getting there. So there we have guys fighting. There we go. Submit photo. Punch club in the newspaper. And uh, yes, we'll do that. And we'll get something for taking that photo. I don't know what. Okay. A little love is all we ever Charcutier. Equipped in the trade union. Maintenance costs minus 30% for something. I don't know what. I didn't have time to see. So we have 220 workers now. So it's definitely time that we get some pigs going here. So let's do that. Right, and they need pastures as well. I need five of them. So we'll build them like this. Whoops. That was wrong. Uh, I want to demolish that. Uh, 
And one, two, three, four, five. All right. Too many changes, I think. Uh, let's check the newspaper. So marvelous to meet you, and that we may show truth or or anything actually in my uh, our broadsheet. Yeah, yeah. So here we have some effects of the newspaper. So plus five happiness, minus fifty percent uh, riot chance, and another plus five ha happiness. That's fine. We can edit the newspaper, so we can stick in something else that, if we want. So we can. Uh, put some in something in for income, to uh, propaganda, the stuff like that. Truth. Shut up, in I'm talking. You do what you're told. So, so we, we can change the newspaper, which has an effect on, uh, on people, uh, on our competitors. So we w want a little bit extra income, is not that's fine. The and of the corrupt. some of our competitors will like it some of us will some of them will hate it and and that's okay all right let's get our road around there we do definitely need a fire station up here so we'll do that and we will upgrade one Two of you, and two of you. So now we have sausages coming in. And how are we looking here? Could do with a bit more schnapps. So let's upgrade you and you. That did put a big dent in our farmer workforce, so let's build some farmer residences. Uh, let's do like that. Like that. And then we can do something like that. Demolish the buildings in the middle. Get some roads going around. And there, and then we can upgrade some of them. Let's upgrade you and you for now. We do have three fisheries. We do need to upgrade this. But see, it's expensive. 15 bricks, 10 timber, and 2,500. But I will do it. And for the workers, I also want to build a sailing shipyard uh, that is something that we need urgently so let's build that there we can't do it yet we need 25 bricks for it so we need to wait for that and i think i'll actually get some more bricks going where do we have more bricks we have more bricks right there so there uh, there and there and a small warehouse. And there we go. Now, there's no timer on this, so we don't have to rush to do that. And it's actually quite expensive to build uh, the, the silo there. So we'll wait a little bit. Uh, we do need a fire station here. The most underestimated of the virtues. And I think we'll build another warehouse uh, over here. Uh, Office your collection quest. Sure, I Margaret. You find it illuminating. Pick up Flotsam. Okay. We'll come over there and pick that up. Does bring us close to the pirate the pirates in there somewhere. Uh, we can't do that yet. But all of this is going now. And we are turning a tiny little profit. And let's get these guys. And next we need grain 
So let's, because we need bread. Now bread needs a grain farm, a flour mill, and a bakery. So a grain farm takes one minute, the flour mill takes half a minute, and the bakery takes one minute. So we need two to one for the flour mills. So let's build some grain farms. Now these take, these need more fields. So I'll do another one like so. And then we'll need a flour mill, which we'll build there. And then we need two bakeries, which we'll build over here. So this is nowhere near enough, but it's a start. Uh, no, not farmer residences. We want a small warehouse. And we definitely want a fire station here as well. So let's build a road around that. Build that, build that, build. Actually, let's get this built so we can start producing ships. We do need to make sails first right, before we can do that. But now we have it, which is important. So we'll build those two. We need some bricks, Oops. and we need some bricks. All right, that's fine. Uh, we picked that up. Attention, uh, so where are we going? Are we going home? All right, let's do that then. And what would she give us? 4,000, that's not bad. Hand-blown grenade. Usable in trade units. Chance of fire minus 40%. That's quite nice. And plus 5 reputation with her, which is quite nice as well. So we have diplomacy here, and she is okay. She's at 50. Vicente is only at 40, and Hugo is at 52. So it's not too bad. But why are we making so little money. We can upgrade some more farmers. But we need to build more farmers as well. So let's build this farmers up here. And build some farmer residences over here. Um, Alright, let's do that. We'll just put that in there. We, ah, we didn't actually need to, but it's fine. Why did that happen? Uh, Demolish that. Hoping to enlighten me. Yes. As loyal as a puppy. Nice. Some money. Some reputation with her. Not bad. Let's send our flagship, flagship back over this way. Uh, I don't want to take that quite quest just yet. Uh, he now has steel beams, which we desperately need. So let's get this built and these two built. So that we start making some grain. And we actually want to build some more grain farms. So... Let's do that. Nope. We're taking every It wasn't actually what I wanted to do, but it's fine. We're gonna need the grain anyway. There's a fire somewhere. Oops, that was incorrect. Now let's uh, demolish there. There. And there. Alright. Very good. We could definitely do with some more workers. So let's upgrade here. And 
and we need to demolish these center houses. And then we can upgrade all of these. Okay. Now... All right. So I think we're off to a pretty decent start. We're making a little bit of money. Flagship awaiting instructions. We are making everything we need also, so far. Bread will be coming in. Bread will be coming in. We do need some soap. And we actually need steel beams for that. And we do need a church and a and some beer. So a church. Where will that fit? It'll fit here. Or will it? No. It'll fit here if we remove one of the roads. No, it won't. Dang it. Okay. What we can do then is relocate that over here and then we can uh, demolish a bit of road here like that and now we should be able to fit a church in here yeah uh, that does mean that that house needs to go Alright, but there's a church. We'll just this one would go over there. But the church we can't upgrade yet. It needs some more bricks, which will be coming soon. So let's upgrade another grain farm. We do need to make sales. So for that we need more sheep. Actually, let's demolish that, and we'll do, no, let's demolish that, we'll do sheep farm there, sheep farm there, and a sheep farm there, and a sheep farm there. Now we don't need that many sheep farms for sales. But we're going to need more work clothes soon anyway, so we might as well just plan them out. And we'll have a road going that way. We will upgrade you and upgrade you. We will have a small warehouse over here. Upgrade that. And then we need some uh, sail makers, which also take Or bricks. So there, we're making sales. And that's 30 seconds, that's 30 seconds. So those two that we built there will feed those two. So that means that we can start making ships soon, which is great. So yeah, we are out of time, guys. So uh, I really hope that you're enjoying NO1800. It's a fantastic game, and Land of Lions is just out last night sometime, my time, and I can't wait to get really into it. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.